is up there, my beautiful, beautiful people. It's your boy Juanito here, representing Juan Step Ahead Fitness. Rocking the shades today. I swear I'm not trying to look cool. It happens totally effortlessly. The thing is, the sun is shining right down on me, so my eyes would be closed the entire time if I wasn't wearing these. So I'm here at a local mosque, Islamic Center. It's very cool architecture. I'll pan out and let you guys see it in a minute, but I'm definitely going to come here and start doing more Tai Chi, more meditation, because something about architecture, the energy of a place, it can make it more conducive to meditation. And as I sit here in the middle of a Star of David on the ground, I can't help but feel, you know, the engravings in the background. It just feels like a good spot to make a video, like a good spot to make. I would like to share some techniques for meditation with you all. And first and most importantly is your folk become better at focusing. Everything else you do will also improve because everything uses focus. Uh, focus, intention. In Tai Chi, they call this Shen. Shen is the originator of your Qi. Most people think that Qi comes from your breath, which it does to some extent. Your food, your water, your movement. But Shen is where everything begins. The idea to take a drink. The idea to eat or to breathe in a certain way. Your focused awareness that is your Shen. Right? I do always good Shen. Whatever it is that you're doing, do it with the best of intentions. You do it with good Shen. So with that, we can move to sitting meditation, right? Medi there's so many different forms. Really anything could be meditation, so long as you focus completely on that one thing. So most people will begin with their breath. You can count your breath as you sit in a comfortable position. Generally, you're taught to sit with your spine straight, although you could lay down as well. You could be walking. Breathe in, and just focus on the sensation of the air passing through your nostrils, down into your belly, for maybe a count of two or three. Hold it in for a count of two or three. Breathe out focusing on the sensation of the air passing out of your nostrils for two or three seconds. And then you can hold again with your lungs empty or after you exhale. Forward from there, you can kind of toggle your breath so that you take longer inhales, longer holds after your inhale, longer exhales, or longer holds after your exhale. We can do progressive relaxation, so as you breathe in, focus on one area, maybe on your toes. As you breathe out, slowly relax. So you'll move from your toes, relax your toes on the exhale, relax your foot on the exhale, relax your ankle, relax your calf, all the way up until your body is completely relaxed. This is a good way to begin. Then from there, maybe enter into some of the visualization exercises. Visualizing, so sometimes what I'll do in my meditation is I'll go over movements that I would like to improve. You know, a handstand, a certain yoga pose, if it's a sport that I'm playing, maybe the swing, a martial arts technique. Just repeat this in your head as if you were actually doing it. Make it very vivid. Feel the sensation of the movement. Feel maybe the sweat on your skin. Feel yourself out of breath and recovering. And you will come to find that inside this mental domain, you have just as much freedom, more freedom even, than you do in the physical domain. You'll also see that as you practice these movements mentally, you will also improve physically. A combination of practicing mentally and physically is the best for optimum performance in my opinion. One that I particularly like is chakra meditation where you will begin the seven chakras. Of so all of these correspond to specific 
physiological functions and also like psychological factors. By moving up or down your spine and feeling the energy circulate through your chakras, that's another way to practice meditation. Something that I've discovered out of Qigong is the idea of when you inhale, nourishing your internal organs and your, your spine, your center, the marrow of your bones, and when you exhale, nourishing the extremities, the muscles, tendons, and digits, top of your head, and even like outside of your skin. Breathe in. You could imagine everything coming in to that center line, and when you breathe out, radiating out of that center line to your extremities. So there we have some basic techniques for meditation. I highly encourage all of you to take up a meditation practice. The best way, in my opinion, to do it is to begin very easily. Just start with three minutes. Set a timer for three minutes. Don't get crazy and try to do 10 or 20 minutes because that can be discouraging. By unlocking the power of concentration, the power of Shen and intention, you will be able to greatly improve your effectiveness in all of your endeavors. The potential we have inside of our body is something that we have not yet completely realized and I do believe that meditation is a way that we can draw this out. I thank you all for watching my video. Again, this is your boy Juanito, signing off. Adios.